Hi, this is Bruce. We're here at NAB uh, talking with Jason from Adobe. Jason, there's been some confusion about this concept called Creative Cloud. It's, people think that it comes from the cloud and you got to work in the cloud. What is Creative Cloud reality? <laughs> So what is Creative Cloud? Well, Creative Cloud first and foremost is all the tools that we have, all the tools that you know and love. So it's everything from Premiere Pro, After Effects, Photoshop, Illustrator, Muse, Edge, Dreamweaver, Acrobat, Lightroom, it's everything and more, including services, services like Adobe Story, which is our online collaborative screenwriting application. You've also got desktop storage, uh, sync and share, so you can share media, share files, you can allow clients to comment and download shared media. You've got publishing capabilities. So if you ever wanted to publish an iPad app, you can publish unlimited iPad apps with digital publishing suite, single edition. You've got website hosting as a Creative Cloud member. So up to five sites automatically, whether you use them or not, you get them with your membership. And then of course there's this concept of always staying a step ahead, always being current, always having the most current version. And whether it comes out today or tomorrow, it'll be there for you, waiting for you to be current and on the latest version of our products. And online, it's, a, it's what? Our, our regular price is $49.99 a month, but the idea is that it's significantly less than the box, you're always current, and your, mem your membership, your license for Creative Cloud, entitles you to work on both operating systems, Mac and, and Windows. So whereas the box, you bought a box of design premium, production premium, and you were limited to, this box is for Mac, this box is for Windows. With Creative Cloud, you still get the same two installs that you had before, but we don't care what operating system you put them on. So it's much more flexible, it's easier to get in, and it also allows you to step outside of the box and perhaps use some applications and things that you may not otherwise have used in the past. And let me get this straight. This is not just Premiere, this is not just After Effects, and this is not just Photoshop. This is everything. This is everything. And to your earlier point, you're still downloading the applications to your desktop. You're accessing them from the cloud in a much more eloquent way. We have something new called the Adobe Application Manager. You literally can see the applications available to you. You can download them. There's no downloading EXEs or DMG files and unpacking and double clicking and putting in serial numbers and waiting and unclicking, unchecking. That all goes away. It's a very seamless process, but you're still downloading the applications to your desktop. So there's no fear that it's running in your browser, nothing like that. And that's that's one of the misconceptions or the myths that we hear a lot. And it's understandable because people hear cloud, they think cloud computing, and it's not that, it's it's different and it's much more. So you said two installs. So just like with the box product, if you buy the box of any of our products, you can use it on two machines. But again, you were you were confined to one operating system. You bought the Windows version of Photoshop or the Windows version of Premiere Pro. With creative with a Creative Cloud membership, the one license entitles you to the same two installs, but you can put it on a Mac and a PC, two Macs, two PCs, it's the, the same one works for both. So it's a lot more flexible. And it's not two downloads, it's just two installs. So you can, if I run out of room, let's say I've got uh, three applications, all of a sudden I just downloaded a, a big file and I had to start on my army drive and, and I didn't have room and I had to, to uh, delete my After Effects for a week or other. Can you go back and re-download it? So here's the other amazing thing. The answer is yes, but also one of the issues that this eliminates. So a lot of times, and this is as recently as today, but I can I can harken back to several years ago where if you, you had two machines and you had your two installs used and your hard drive dies and it's the weekend and you can't get a hold of support and now you've used your two installs so if you try and install it again from the disk, it tries to validate, it can, it says they're both used, you were stuck. Well, with Creative Cloud, you can virtually uh, disable, enable, deauthorize, unauthorize, or reauthorize your licenses if you're in that situation. So that goes away, and it's just that much more flexible. And when you go into our Creative Cloud for Teams and Enterprise offerings, you actually have centralized administration, deployment, uh, license configuration control. So literally, people can come and go from your organization. You can <laughs> authorize and deauthorize as necessary. If you bring freelancers into your organization, it's very easy to, to authorize and deauthorize remotely. Um, it's just amazingly flexible, and I, you know, it, it sounds salesy to say all of that, but it's true. And the great point I picked up was, you're always current. If I bought CS5 and all of a sudden CS6 comes out, but I really don't have the money right now, so I'm going to wait for CS7 because I know that there's going to be a bigger upgrade. I'm always up to date. You're always up to date, and as long as you have your membership, you're just going to get these updates as they come to you. Great. So how do we find out more? <laughs> creative.adobe.com. You can also sign up for a free membership as well. So while we have our individual team and enterprise plans, 
creative.adobe.com, get a free Adobe ID. If you've ever been on our forums or done sort of online tech support, you probably already have one. If not, it's free. You can start downloading 30-day trials. We give you two gigs of storage for free just because, and you can start playing with it and really start experiencing what the Creative Cloud is all about. Excellent. Thank you very much.